The African Union took a decision that members urgently lift or travel bans and restrictions on air, sea and land to respect the principle of free movement of people. This means that people from infected areas should be allowed to travel and be screened at airports and be quarantined if any is found infected, recommendations that Cabinet had also endorsed. Prime Minister Hagegin Gob explained that it was therefore on this basis that peace pay was granted visas and allowed into the country. He added that he did not, however, take in the decisions only, but consulted with relevant ministries such as Foreign Affairs, Health and Home Affairs, who both explained the African Union's stand to lift restrictions placed on travelling from Ebola-affected countries. Last week, the Minister of Home Affairs and Immigration said it will not issue travel documents to people from Ebola-affected countries, but the move was not based on WHO recommendation but an agreement between individual countries. Following the Cabinet endorsement to implement WHO recommendation, the Ministry has now changed its decision and lifted the restriction.